So I'm going to be giving my thoughts on what occurred at the latest Morbid Angel show. Uh, first things first, uh, rest in peace to the fallen metalhead. Uh, you will be missed. And to everyone that was injured, the 18 people that were injured, uh, hope they make um, a quick and full recovery. So, uh, you know, a bit of context uh, was a show with uh, Morbid Angel and the other bands uh, were Crypta, Revocation, and Skeletor Remains. Awesome bands. And, yeah, sadly, uh, a roof collapsed and took the life of one person. And, um, yeah, horns up to um, the people that were helping each other. Um, that were helping each other make it to the hospital and helping everyone else uh, so they can make it in one piece. Now... Of course, uh, I wouldn't shift any blame, not to the managers, not to the uh, merch people, uh, not to the bands or the fans. And yes, the fans also are uh, very devastated. I have seen Fernanda Lira's Instagram and her eyes were tearing up. At the fact that a fan has become, uh, sorry, that a fan has been killed uh, by the roof collapsing. And yeah, really sad about the fan. So yeah, this uh, man, uh, just like any of us metal fans, we're going there to blow off some steam, to see metal bands that we like. But, uh, you know, not making it home. Uh, we can't imagine that ever happening at a show. And to the ones that did make everyone else that made it out alive, uh, really sad. Uh, that they'll be going through uh, this trauma maybe next show they go to they'll be uh, kind of frightened of this happening again or if they see the if they go uh, to see the same band and have that same fear and to the fallen metalhead my condolences to his family and friends and also uh, to the fans for them for losing a fan like this. Now what I would question is how uh, they still decided to um, go through with the show despite the weather warnings and all that. Uh, from what I heard, there were already weather warnings to, uh, sorry, there were already weather warnings, so, uh, you know, maybe you think that, hey, maybe the show was postponed or something. I think I remember a girl being interviewed. And she says she texted some friends of hers not to come to the venue. And of course, I wouldn't blame the fans because, you know, obviously a fan because of excitement and all that stuff. You think that, you know, you're just going to go to a show, that nothing's going to happen and all that stuff because, you know, why would you think that? And... The bands, obviously, I don't blame them. They need to, um, you know, put food on their tables and 
uh, you know, they need to be able to carry on with uh, their profession. So, yeah. Okay, so, yeah, horns up to the fallen metalhead, the injured, hope they make a full and quick recovery. Um, the ones who made it out in one piece, hope you guys uh, keep going strong and not have, uh, and not go through the, uh, the trauma of this. And hope they don't go through a survivor's guilt or anything like that. I wasn't there or anything, but, you know, some people will feel that and, you know, it's really, it's horrible. And also, um... Uh, Horns up to Morbid Angel, Revocation, Crypta, and Skeletor Remains. I'm glad they're well, uh, and I hope uh, they can carry on with the tour. And that they also don't go through um, the trauma and all that. So yeah, horns up 